You're also looking at uh, the polar bear. And by the way, best research has discovered that in every polar bear that's alive today, there's a bit of the Irish. You wouldn't think of polar bears being in Ireland, but <laughs> how does, first of all, how does that happen? <laughs> how are they all connected to the Irish? Well, uh, did you see in the news recently, in the last couple of years, that there are polar bear, brown bear hybrids that people have found, hunters have found in it's in happening Canada. now as the climate is changing. Yeah, and so that's happening because polar bears and brown bears are actually not that different from each other. They only diverged from a common ancestor probably around 500,000 years ago or maybe less than that. So they're still very closely related to each other and they can breed and produce hybrid, fertile hybrid offspring. And it turns out that they do this whenever their ranges overlap. And the last time their ranges overlapped was actually around the last ice age, just before the last ice age, where a lot of ice was formed over the, the North Pole and it pushed polar bears onto land. The extent of their habitat was at the edge of this ice flow, which was on land. And, and brown bears, because there were glaciers on land, were pushed to the edge of their habitat. And again, they interbred. And, and Ireland happened to be the meeting and point. And it happened to have happened in Ireland indeed. <laughs> and uh, so an Irish brown bear is actually the mother of all living polar bears. And none of the Irish bears are left today. No, the Irish bears, brown bears have been extinct in Ireland since about six, maybe 8,000 years ago. But taking that research, what does that say for polar bears today? And, and that's survival of that species, given we've seen hybridization occur in the past. Uh, it didn't work out so well for the woolly mammoth because the humans were there, but we've, we've been here now and the polar bears have sort of survived us. Now, polar bears are, are threatened because they require sea ice to be able to survive. And Will they survive with hybrid? Can they hybridize again and then go back and become polar bears yeah, again? Yeah, you know, this, it's a good question and it's one that people have asked, but I think that if the only way that the polar bear can survive is by hybridizing with a brown bear and those hybrids then mate with brown bears, you're going to get only brown bears and the, the polar bear will go extinct. The only way that it can survive is if those hybrids manage to find other populations of polar bears to then breed with or places to live where they can be polar bears. They'll hybridize. The genetic material will still be there, just like there's Neanderthal genetic material in all of us, right? But they won't be polar bears.